Hey bestie, did you know that your boss has to give you time off to recover from childbirth or to get an abortion? I bet you're wondering how that's possible, so let's dive in. These changes are part of new workplace protections through the Pregnant Workers Fairness Act. Discrimination against pregnant people in the workplace has run rampant for years, necessitating new legislation that would clamp down on employers who fire workers rather than accommodate their needs. After more than a decade of advocacy, the law passed in December 2022 and went into effect in summer 2023. But it wasn't until now that the Equal Employment Opportunity Commission, which enforces the law, released its final regulations that detail exactly how the law will work in practice. If a worker requests time off to recover from childbirth or get an abortion, employers must in good faith accommodate those needs. At minimum, that means unpaid time off. But employers can also offer paid time off if they wish to. If an employer cannot accommodate the request for time off, they can deny the request, but only if they can prove that implementing the changes would create undue hardship on the business. The attorneys that helped advocate for this law said that it would be difficult to prove as the accommodations are only temporary. There's so much more detail to this story, so head over to Up North News to learn more.